Hey, what up? Uh, making a video on how to set up Streamlabs OBS like I have this set up right now. I have my follower count right here, my uh, donation goal right over here, my logo, ZFG Nation. Check them out. Um, link will be down below. I'm affiliate of ZFG. I uh, got my viewer count, got my tip jar, my cam. I'm not showing it because I'm recording, but I have it all right here. And want to know how to set it up? Well, I got you in this video. We live, baby, yeah. Yeah. So, to start the video, I'm just gonna reset everything that you see here and set it up. It's real quick and easy to do. I'm gonna go to delete cache and reset. Alright, what you wanna do is either with your Twitch or YouTube, link it to your Streamlabs OBS. And once you do that, it's going to do a verification thing once again, storefronts, whatever. Verify. Do not do import from OBS because it's not going to do the right settings at all. So make sure you know exactly what your OBS settings were. And start fresh. I'm pretty much going to have everything checked off. Chat box. I'm going to add widgets for all of these right here. Don't need stream boss, it's like a health thing, so whenever someone does something, your health goes down. I'll probably add that later, but don't need that. Don't need credits. So, I'm going to add these nine widgets. It's going to do, you can do optimize if you want to optimize, but if you already know your previous settings, there's really no point in doing it. But I'm just going to show you what it does anyway. Station in Japan, so it knows I'm in Asia. And it's done. Alright, now once you do the settings, you want to go to settings and see exactly what it put for your stream settings. It put mine for Hong Kong. Uh, what did it put my output bitrate? And as you can see, it will fuck it up, so just do it manual. Put mine back to advance. I use my CPU, constant bit rate. I put mine on 4800 because I have a high upload speed, so that's why. High, don't need that. Blase, blase, blase. Make sure your audio is what you want it to be, like my mic. Video, 1080, 720, there is no point of you doing 1080p unless you're partnered. So, keep it at 720p. Of course, I'm going to put mine at 60 frames a second. Make sure it's 32 so I get the best quality. Hit OK. Double check my settings. I don't want to put it for Hong Kong but I usually go with auto for the most part but I'll just keep it at that for now double check everything's good everything's good I don't need to do this why is it that's just for recording so when I'm streaming I keep it just like that audio but we're not here for that so I'm gonna show you let me add these widgets now I'm gonna add alert box alert box basically keep it right there keep it in the center add my game capture so I can show you the background and what the music is going on let's say if I want to show overwatch that I have in the background right now specific window overwatch pal it's on there make sure I put it at the bottom alert box it's right there in the center remember that I'm gonna add my jar the jar it's right here you can barely see it let me go to another menu in overwatch see my jar here it's showing bam make it small at next 
widget donation goal bet donation goal I just put a random one oculus riff bam showing at the bottom easy now I'm gonna add a follower goal what add follower goal bam easy right there I want to add let's say event list bam easy I'll just put it right here bam easy all easy for your account I just put it right there I just put my camera right there easy I got the alert box got the jar got the event list got the donation goal got the follower goal uh, view account stream label credits chat box if you want to have a chat box and this is all set up through your stream labs on your actual website so whatever you have set up on there if you want me to make a video for that comment down below but uh yeah it's already set up on the Streamlabs website, so the only thing you're doing is just plotting on here without having to put the URLs onto it on here on the original OBS. So chat box. Let's just say I want to have it like right next to me. Bam, easy. Get the jar, follow a goal, donation ticker. I don't know if I put that. I don't remember, but I will put it like down below too. Easy. View account, chat box, big goal, follow goal. All right, and then what you want to do is when you want to test everything out, go to test widgets. So let's say I got to follow. My alert box is in the center, remember? So it's going to show it right there. Center of the screen. Easy. Subscription. Shows on the bottom right again. All right. This is a test. This is supposed to be over here. <laughs> well, whatever. It popped up over there. Donation. Tails. And I got a host. Alert box. Once again, in the center. Macho Man Randy Savage. Top of the line. And I'm going to go test out my bits. Oh, yeah. This is a test bit alert. And that's pretty much how you set up Streamlabs OBS. Like I said, mainly you want to have it set up in your Streamlabs on a website, and it will have every setting and everything on there. And then you just, whenever you install Streamlabs OBS, it will be right in here. And it's easier to do than having to do URLs and then post it and then put the text thing inside here. So. Uh, if you want me to make a more in-depth video, comment down below. Thank you all for watching. It's easy. Nerd on. Thank you everyone for watching. Please like if you enjoyed the video, share, and subscribe. Remember everyone always, nerd on.